It just brings out all these mad sounds and it's like he just took all like Albert King and you know, like loads of, you know, Freddie King, BB King, Three Kings if you want, you know, and it just took it all. I'm, I'm, I'm having all this, this is mine, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna take all these influences and, and just throw it back out at you and he just had, and that, that you know, all like the Curtis Mayfield flurries and his playing and that kind of really like wet my appetite for playing guitar and made me want to play like more than anything in the world and I, I think he, um, I think he just had, he, he was so earthy. Everyone puts him down as a rock guy, but when you've heard Hendrix play the blues, like Electric Church, Red House, and you know, some of the older, really, you know, them stripped down jams that you hear him doing on the bootlegs, and he, he was the finest blues player who's ever existed in human history, as far as anyone's concerned, and you know, well, as far as I'm concerned, at least anyway. And I think his influence can still be felt, like, you know, anyone today, if you look at the likes of like Stevie Ray Vaughan from the 80s. It's just like that next step, and then Joe Bonamassa, and then Philip Sace, and like a lot of brilliant players coming out at the moment. I, I think that, you know, it, that, that uh, I don't know, that fire that he sparked under everyone's still there, and it certainly made me want, want to play more than anything. So I would definitely say Hendrix, and particularly Hendrix playing the blues, was the biggest influence as a guitar player for me. And that performance at Woodstock, where you can see everything that he you know, his whole heart and soul is going into it. And he, it's one of them kind of, I don't know, almost religious experiences watching that back. He's one of them people that even if um, I've never met him, I feel like I, I've known him my whole life. I, I think when you can think about someone like that, you know, I just listen to the music, that's obviously massively strong. And I, I really, I get that. And I, that, that to me is, you know, a really bluesy, rootsy, earthy, you know, from the ground up feeling.